So here we are, Jurassic Park 3. We're over at Universal on set trying to work out all the puppeteering. I think these are rehearsals before we actually started shooting. And we had teams of puppeteers on each bird, six puppets. So we had people, you know, doing heads and body and wings. This is a shot of the lone bird there that I was puppeteering the body on. It's been a while and I don't remember if I was also doing the head or if we split the head and body into different puppeteers. There were, I believe, three puppeteers for each puppet. Uh, one on the body, one on the head, and one on the wings. The wings were a really cool fabric blend. It was spandex, that, uh, very thin spandex that had foam latex silk screened onto it in a, a variegated sort of pattern that gave the illusion of being a proper wing membrane. They were basically rod puppets, and this really fit in with our philosophy of direct rod puppeted motion for the broad strokes, and it really helps you get that organic bird-like feeling. Here we're chasing after a, uh, a head, the head's representing a target, so we're, uh, the people on the bodies and the neck and heads are coordinating to uh, move the baby pteranodon in a convincing manner to focus on a, a point. It sort of uh, helps everyone who's on the bird operate as a team. Good stuff overall, great memories. So having not seen this footage for a number of years, it was cool to see it again because I think we had some really organic puppeteering, very realistic. It was a bit difficult to put together in the rehearsal stages in the beginning because we had to coordinate so many puppeteers to be working in concert with each other. But we had a, a good couple of days of rehearsal and then when we got into it, things just started to happen organically, which it does with puppets and animatronics on set because when you, you know, throw an actor into the mix and you, you can start reacting to what he's doing and, and he can start reacting to what you're doing and, and that's when the magic and the chemistry happens. All right, cut.